I'm in my tag room known as the Jazzy Green Office. For those of you who do not know, I love doing tags. So if you guys ever do a tag and you think that I might be interested in doing it, please go ahead and feel free to tag me, okay? Because I love doing them. So anyway, I'm doing a tag called the 14 question tag. I think that's the, the name of it, the 14 question tag. I don't know who started this tag, but I saw it on a lady named Barbara Jean and her channel is called Age is Just a Number by Barbara Jean. So if you're interested in seeing her, her video, I will have the link to her channel down in my description box. So anyway, let's get started with these 14 questions. So this is going to be nice and quick. Number one, and I'm going to try not to use these specs. What month were you born? I was born in February, the month of love, the month of uh, Valentine's Day, the month of Black History Month. Great month. What a great month. Two, what is your zodiac sign? Well, I don't identif identify with zodiac signs. I don't believe in zodiac signs. But since it's a question, I'll just answer it. <laughs> Uh, the month of February, um, society says um, it's Pisces, especially with my birthday. So, Pisces. Number three, what is your worst subject? Ooh, math, M-A-T-H. My gosh. I have to say, that is my worst subject and was. Uh, I struggled through all my school years with math. Um, I stayed in basic math all 12 years of school. <laughs> I know that may be funny to some of you. I didn't take pre-algebra. I didn't take algebra or geometry. Oh, Lord of mercy. Mm, mm -mm. No, I would never have made it. Uh, I, I was kind of slow with comprehension. and. I still struggle with comprehension to this day, as a matter of fact. So, you know, me and numbers, we just don't get along. I try to run as far as, as, as I can away from math. So, whew, don't like math. Math is scary. Okay, number four. What is your favorite cereal? Um, well, I don't eat cereal anymore because um, I don't like milk. So, I would just say... Uh, granola, any type of granola or oatmeal. I like oatmeal. Put the cinnamon in it and um, if you're going to use sugar, sugar or maybe some stevia for me. Okay, number five. What is your favorite color? For those of you who know me, you know it's red and pink or pink and red. I love both colors. Uh, those are my number one uh, number two favorite colors, pink and red. Okay, moving right along. Number six, what is your favorite sandwich? Well, typically, now that I'm on a weight loss journey, I don't normally eat sandwiches anymore. Um, if I do, you know, I'll stop by Starbucks, uh, not Starbucks, uh, what is that? Uh, Subway sandwich. I'll go to Subway and get a six inch sandwich and nothing but veggies and I'm telling you it is delicious it's satisfying and it's fulfilling so if you guys are on a weight loss, loss journey like I am and you want to try something you know like that go to Subway and get you a veggie sandwich just put nothing but veggies in there it's so good it's, it's satisfying at least to me it is but I love it love it love it Number seven, what is your favorite car? Well, I've got three. A BMW? Mm -hmm. I don't know what number. I just know I like BMW. I like the Lexus, such a beautiful car, and a Hummer. You know, those Hummers are just adorable. I love them. I can see myself up high sitting in that Hummer driving, you know, somewhere. Number eight, what is your favorite board game? 
Well, I don't play games. Um, I don't normally play board games, but I would have to say Monopoly. When I was a child, I loved playing Monopoly, so Monopoly would have to be it. Anything dealing with money. <laughs> okay, number nine. Where did you grow up? I grew up in the heart of Los Angeles, California. Yeah, so that's it. Los Angeles, California. Number 10. Who was your favorite Disney character? Mickey Mouse. I love Mickey Mouse. He is so sweet, isn't he? He's just so adorable. I mean, who does not like Mickey Mouse? I mean, my daughter loves Mickey Mouse. My son loves Mickey Mouse. I mean, Mickey Mouse is just so universal. He is just so popular. So, Mickey. Number 11, who was your hero? Hmm. I don't have a hero, and I, I don't think I ever had one that Michael Jackson was my hero at that time. Um, now that I'm grown, um, I don't have a hero, so I'll just say Jesus, because he died for my sins. Okay? Yeah. Okay, number 12, have you ever performed on stage? Yes, I have. I was a dancer for all 12 years of my uh, growing up, so I had ballet, tap and jazz, dance recitals, and in high school, I um, performed and, um, you know, did dancing in my uh, shows that we would, you know, do and um, plays that I performed in. I didn't really have too many uh, speaking parts, you know, acting parts, because I didn't like acting, so I tried to stick with dancing as much as possible. Number 13, did you go to a private or public school? I went to a public school all 12 years. I don't think my mother would have been able to afford a private school. It was expensive and it is more expensive nowadays than any day. So um, I put my daughter in public school, no not public school, private school for the first uh, six years and um, then she transitioned to public school, and Aaron has been in public school all, all along. So, public school for me. And last and final question, who was your celebrity, celebrity crush? Now, I'm married. Why do you want to ask me a question like that? But anyway, I got to answer it. And the question says, who was? Okay, so this person was no longer now. I would say back in the day, Billy D. Williams was my celebrity crush, and one more person, um, Michael Knight from the uh, Knight Rider. Remember those, that show, Knight Rider, back in the day? Anyway, those would be my celebrity crushes uh, from back in the day. And if you ask me who's my celebrity crush now, it's my husband. That's right. He is my celebrity crush. <laughs> That's right. I gotta say my husband because he is. That's why I married him. But anyway, <laughs> let me stop fooling around anyway. But anyway guys, that completes this tag and it was a lot of fun as you can see how I get comical with this. Uh, it's all for fun. But anyway, I'm tagging everybody who would like to participate. Go ahead and do this tag. I will have the questions in my description box. So go ahead and copy and paste them, all right? And thank you, Billy, um, let's see, Barbara, sorry. Thank you, Barbara Jean, for uh, doing this tag. Uh, I enjoyed your answers, and I hope you guys have enjoyed mine. So anyway, thanks, guys. This was so much fun. Thanks so much for watching, and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.